Hi everyone, I'm Dan Jemis, broker owner of the Dan Jemis Real Estate Team. As many of us know, Essex County has been a vital hub for Ontario's wine industry. At the Dan Jemis Team, we thought what better way to share our love for the industry than to share with you our latest Essex County Wineries video series. In this series, we'll feature a different winery in each video, all of which can be found directly on our website at danjemis.com. In this video, we feature Peg Leone Estate Winery. The winery's Tuscan-style architecture and welcoming ambiance offers guests a unique experience steeped in culture and traditional charm. Let's take a look. Uh, we grow mostly, we have 10 acres of grape, we grow mostly red grapes. Um, so our wines are medium-bodied red, mainly known for our Cap Franc and our new Erie blend we, we have, which is a blend of five of our grapes. We're doing our wines old world, no chemical, no, no additives in our wines, just totally natural grape. When people come, we have, we offer them four tastings of wine. On Fridays, Saturdays, Sundays, we have our wood oven pizza going. And uh, on the weekends, we do about 150 to 200 pizzas and antipasto trays, different kinds of cheeses and olives. And all my kids help me here. They all have their full-time jobs, but they are all here helping me with everything. We have small weddings coming up. Uh, we can sit comfortably 75 inside and uh, 100 outside. So we do have two small weddings coming up in August. It would be our first weddings here. Uh, we do bridal showers and baby showers and uh, have a golf night coming in on Friday night after they're golfing. And uh, well, my husband wanted to get an uh, Italian feel, being born and raised in Italy. Um, he wanted people to come in and feel like they're at home. And uh, he wanted to be very unique with the, the style and the character and uh, with the wood oven pizzas outside. The people just love being here, relaxing and en enjoying the feel of the winery. Uh, we had been looking at rental properties for a retirement income. I was still in nursing, working at 37 years in nursing. I came home in 2007, March. My husband said, come see this property. So we drove out here. And uh, he says, I put an offer in on this property today. I go, oh, okay, so I guess we're getting into the wine business. It was already established vineyard, owned by another winery at the time. And then we um, took it over and took the grapes over anyways. There was no buildings or anything here. My husband built this building. It took three years to build in between construction jobs. And we opened up July 19th, 2013. He passed away a couple months ago and so um, I got all my kids helping me with the wine. Everyone knows what to do and, uh, and um, I'm keeping his legacy alive. This was his dream, his passion. Um, he was a social butterfly. Anybody came in, had a birthday or anniversary, he played the concertina and he had everybody laughing. He told jokes and so I'm going to try to carry on. I'm not a social butterfly like he was, but I will try. <laughs> That's Peg Leone Estate Winery. To learn more about them, visit their website at peglioneestatewinery.com. To watch the many other featured wineries in our Essex County Wineries video series, head over to our website at danjemis.com. On behalf of all of us at the Dan Jemis Real Estate Team, thanks for watching.